Hi guys, just another quick tip for you today. This one has to do with the mixer again. I'm talking about insert routing. I tend to use a submix and the submix heads to the master and everything in the entire project is routed to the submix before it goes to the master. So if I turn the submix off, you literally hear no audio. I also use a lot of buses. These are buses, this entire group of tracks right here, that's bused to this one thing. That helps me stay organized. If we go over here to the submix, take a look at the arrows right here. I call them arrows. I don't, I don't know what else to call them. I'm going to call them arrows. You can find out if things are or aren't routed just by looking at the color of the arrows. Let's look at the arrows right now. I'm selecting random tracks here. They're all white. If I look at my submix and I click on that, all these are now grayed out, which means everything here has been routed to the submix. So that's a really fast way of determining what is and isn't routed to the proper place. Because on occasion, you'll get one track that isn't routed and you can discover it easily. So hopefully that helped.